Hi, accepted students. My name is Tommaso Scotti. I am a graphic design concentration here at the School of Fine Arts. I'm from Westport, Connecticut, and I am a first year student. Thanks, Tommaso. I'm Elizabeth Foodie, admissions coordinator. You can't see me right now, but we're going to get to know Tommaso a little bit and show you around our spaces. So, Tommaso, why did you choose UConn? I chose UConn because it was the right price, it has a great program, and a gorgeous campus. Great, and what has surprised you most about UConn since you've been here? Probably the rigor. I wasn't expecting it to have such an intense art curriculum and gen ed curriculum. I'm enjoying all my classes, even though they are challenging, but that's what makes them fun. Great, and I know that you started school obviously in a, in a difficult time during COVID-19, but what is your favorite place on campus? <sighs> Probably Horse Barn Hill is definitely the favorite place because last semester was a COVID semester, so to speak. We couldn't really be inside. And so what we do is we take our picnic blankets and our dinners and stuff and go hang out at Horse Barn and watch the sunset and then walk back home. It was a great time. Great. And if your younger brother or sister were considering UConn, what would you tell them? I would tell them, although UConn is a fairly large school, that is one of its pluses. You can make a really big school feel small because there's so many different people, so you can find your community. But if you go to school of around 400, 500 kids, you can't really expand to more than that. So you can't make that small school feel big. Sounds good. Thanks, Tommaso. We're going to mask up and bring you into the building. See you in a minute. Okay, here we are. We're inside the art building at the University of Connecticut. Tommaso's going to give us a little tour around. Yes, yeah, so welcome to the inside of the fine art building. So you can see there is plenty of light to showcase all the beautiful artwork. If you follow me, I'll show you a little bit more of the rest. To my left, we have what we call the pit. It's a lot of times where people showcase their work or we have critique. Um, you'll definitely be seeing a lot of time here. Right across the way is the contemporary art galleries too. A lot of times we have visiting artists and the MFA students have their shows there at the end of the semester. And if you follow me, let's go to some classrooms. Right now, it's the end of the semester. We are sort of wrapping everything up. Normally, you'd see art everywhere, all over these walls. It's just this morning, we took down some of our work. Um, but you can see here, um, through Counterproof Press, they've just released the Yukon Grief Project, which is a little book slash scene. And then here are more artboards. This is where you would have some of your critiques. Those studio classes are definitely long, three hours, but you get a lot of work done, which is great. As we head in here, here's one of the drawing classes. Tons of natural light, tons of space. Um, here's some work from my actual drawing two class. These are drawing garbage bags. Not so glamorous, but definitely really helpful with the technique. Looks good. Lots of natural light in the skylights. All right, Tommaso. All right, we'll so we're gonna, going. Yeah, we're gonna head over to Bishop, which houses the print, uh, printmaking and a lot of DMD stuff. Welcome to the print shop. Um, as one, as part of your freshman year, or just part of your art curriculum in general, you have to take those basic studios. I'm currently in basic printmaking. As you can see here, we have a wide range of printing. We have litho printing and woodcut, and these are our two giant presses, one for intaglio and then one for lino printing. Um, we have screen printing. So many opportunities for you to make the art that you want. Um, yeah. Welcome to the screen printing uh, studio. Normally we keep a lot of the etching and lino printing over there, but here we have booths where you can screen print, you can um, burn your screen with photo emulsion, and as you can see on the wall, there's so many different art projects. I myself am a graphic design major, and that really encompasses anything. I can screen print a poster, I can make a sculpture and take a photograph of it, or another type of poster. Really, I truly think that's the luckiest part of being a design major. I'm a little bit biased myself, but it, you can do so much with it. You can illustrate, you can paint, you can print make. So that's why it's really lucky. 
Anyways, I hope that you guys got a little taste of art here at UConn. Hopefully I will see you in the fall. Anyways, roll Huskies. <laughs> Thanks, Tommaso. Let's go Huskies. Ooh.